Close your eyes, watch your breath. Try to develop some goodness inside. Wherever there's goodness, okay, that's your home. Wherever you have a opportunity to do good things, whether it's outside or inside, that's your home. So make a home right now inside. Try to be aware of the breath. Be alert to the breath. And if the breath isn't comfortable, you can change. Make it longer, shorter, faster, slower. Whatever kind of breathing feels good right now. This way you give the mind a home. So wherever you go, you feel at ease, you feel at home. This is your place. And then we've got goodness inside like this. It's a lot easier to do good outside as well. We're going to have a very busy weekend coming up, so make sure that your inner resources here are good, that you have your resting place inside, and that your actions, when you're dealing with people and when you're working individually, okay, your actions are coming from a place of strength, a place of well-being. That way it doesn't wear you out. Back when we were building the jetty, what Dhamma said it, we'd work for hours and hours and hours, way into the night, sometimes 3 a.m., sometimes all the way to dawn. And people noticed that as long as they were staying with their breath, it didn't wear them out. As soon as they stopped meditating, started chatting with this person, chatting with that person, letting their minds wander all over the place, okay, then they were worn out and they couldn't work. But the work goes well when you're coming from a good center, because you're constantly producing energy inside with your concentration with your mindfulness. So how do this inner generator going, the humming away inside? You feel it's secure, you feel well settled right here. Okay, That's a position of strength. No matter what you do, what comes out of that strength is going to be good. 